Thanks, Tasha. The Air Force and the aerospace industry are hoping to address a national pilot shortage by inspiring high school students to pursue aviation careers. Eyewitness News reporter Ashley Speller spoke one-on-one -on -one with a Northside student who is heading to the skies this summer. Alexander Ruxtool is only 17 but is already striking gold. I think that I'm hardworking. I, I don't stop. The Clark High School junior and JROTC marksman was just awarded a full ride to Purdue University in Indiana to get her private pilot's license. A usual flight program for to get your uh, pilot certificate or pilot's license takes like months to get. So for us students, they're cramming it all into eight weeks. So at the end of the eight weeks, I will be able to fly my own planes. Alex was only one of 137 students in the country selected. In the beginning, I always thought I was going to be like a mechanic in the Air Force. But after going through uh, Air Force University in high school, I realized I wanted to become a pilot. One minute. And those JROTC instructors help keep her eye on the target. But it gets very difficult at times. They're very uh, strict on everything, make sure that you're always doing the right thing. But their goal is to push you to be a better person. Alex's parents also say they're proud of her. Whenever the children are better than the parents, you feel like you've done something right in your life. Most parents might be nervous about their kids taking flight, but her dad says he's not worried. You know, she learned how to drive, uh, what, two months ago, three months ago. So that's actually worth, you know, more scarier than being a pilot as far as I'm concerned. Alex plans to join the Air Force after graduating next year. No one my age really gets this opportunity, so being given the opportunity is just, it's, I'm grateful for it. I want to be her first passenger, absolutely. Ashley Speller, Kent's 5 Eyewitness News.